My name is Nava Saritas, a chemical engineer specializing in polymer technology. Today I'm here in commemoration of World Earth Day with a theme of Planet Against Plastic. Let's talk about plastic pollution. We have had enough of plastics. We are looking at the production of plastics since its inception. We have now more than 450 million tons of plastics in circulation. These plastics are harmful to our bodies, in which that these plastics, we dump them into water bodies, and these plastics change into small microscopic parts, and they are sold by fish. And then after being sold by fish, we come and get fish, and we eat that fish. It means when we eat this fish, we have also sold in the word the plastics and which they can cause harm and danger in, in our bodies. So the time to take action is now and as we commemorate the world at the we got to stop the plastics that are causing so much to the environment. Plastic can block water channels and that can reduce can reduce the rate of evaporation and even people cannot get what to drink. And the water that even the, the little water that they get can be contaminated with those microplastics. To cut down the use of these plastics, we have got to conduct enough education for all the communities and also give them alternatives to plastics. We understand before the industry of plastics in 1950s, we used to carry things, people used to package their products in different packaging, packaging materials. So why not now? We got to create innovative solutions which are really friendly to the environment. Everywhere you move, there is a plastic. But as a chemical engineer, I can tell you we can convert the plastic waste that is all over our environment into construction material. Most of the human activities that have brought about climate change include mining from our environment, stone quarrying, but we could actually substitute these products that we are mining from the environment with a plastic that is sitting everywhere in the environment and we reuse them, we, give, we create a purpose for these plastics. The governments worldwide have remained behind in doing their part. The government have not been able to come up with strict policies, especially that can pin the companies that are producing plastics. So the governments, our government and other governments worldwide have got to act and take action in ensuring that they save the lives of their people by ensuring that people are safe from eating these plastics and they are also putting in enough policies to control the production industry of plastics. While we are at the center of designing these innovative solutions, the gap we need to fill is mindset change and creating more awareness to our people so that they can adopt to these new innovations.